You almost said Mark. I know. <laughs> I was going to get it first and you'd be like, what? <laughs> but anyway, this is our daily vlog and we were just talking about, uh, we switched our training split up yesterday. We started yesterday, we started our yesterday. six day oh. training split. And it's really odd, um, even for me, I've been training for, I've been training in the gym for, uh, I don't know, six, seven years now, five, six, seven, something like that. Um, but I've always done, usually always done a one day a week, a bodybuilding split is what, what it's called, a bodybuilding split, chest day, back day, leg day, so on and so forth. Uh, and I've done anywhere from 15 to 20 sets of that muscle group, and then I've only done it once a week, and I've had pretty good results from it. Mm -hmm. So we switched it up yesterday. yesterday. It was chest day, heavy. Heavy, yesterday. we went heavy. Yeah. Um, we're doing six, six day a week, so we're gonna hit each muscle group twice a week. So basically a push day, a pull day, a leg day, the repeat. Beginning of the week's gonna be heavy, the end of the week's gonna be lighter weight, more reps, more volume. Um, and I'm extremely sore. We did just a few moves yesterday, yeah. less than we one. Did we did nine sets. Did initially, right. Not including the two, two or three warm-up sets. Right, no, not including warm-up sets. Nine working but sets what we for chest. Used to, 15, 15 sets. to 18 sets, working Something sets. Like that. And I'm just as sore, which this is going to be an experience. I was one after yesterday, and I'm sore. Oh, I'm Me sore. Me too. <laughs> and it's usually delayed, <laughs> you know, myself. delayed onset or delayed yeah, my onset muscle soreness, DOMS, is usually not the day after, but the day after that. So it's this is gonna be an awesome tomorrow. experiment. What? It's gonna hurt tomorrow. I know. Cause it hurts. But today. my chest is one of my my weak points anyway. I'm flat up here. Me and, too. <laughs> See, Look. you can fix that though. That's just like surgery and you can fix that. Like six, seven thousand dollars? <laughs> I can go six, seven, <laughs> if you all want to fund Look, my flatness. I had a I had a buddy I used to work with. This dude, <laughs> if you ever happen to watch this Stiltner, I have to tell your story. But this guy's um, in his fifties. Uh -huh. Looks great. I mean, he's I look great he, he's got his shoulders. I mean, he's he looks great. Yeah. I mean, he's really he's worked hard for what he's got. And he told me one time he walked into a um, a gas station and the girl asked him if he had breast implants, and he like. You know, he was oh, just like, are you freaking serious? Oh, I have goodness. worked my ass off for this. <laughs> Such an insult. Because, I mean, he looked, I'm telling you, he looks really good. He's got a big chest and shoulders, and he's worked hard for what he's got. <laughs> he has, you have implants. I think Technical he just walked implants. out. <laughs> I would have walked out too. That's yeah, that's, that's so insulting. That's probably like asking a woman if she's pregnant or when she's oh, due and she's pregnant. No. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes we should keep our inside thoughts inside. Right. But anyway. So, yeah, today is Sunday, October 28th, 2018. Uh, this is just a One daily, a daily meal of what? It's been about a year for me. Oh, yeah? yeah. It's like anniversary? Like this is your gym anniversary? Uh, no. <laughs> been like a year but overall you said five six, i wish we years. would have taken more pictures of you for before and after because you have made amazing results I'm a beast. you are a beast did you see the picture i posted on I did. instagram I did this morning <laughs> actually i didn't see it on instagram i saw it on and, facebook and facebook and I was like <laughs> so i'm a country girl waste. i sound like from Appalachia. From Appalachia. We live in Appalachia, y'all. We, we like it We here, got though. shoes on. We love it We're here. smart. <laughs> I got three degrees. I even got my teeth. Yeah, look. Um, <laughs> that's a stereotype. Shame on you. We love it here. Yeah. I moved here intentionally. But we have gone way off topic, way off base. Okay, but, but nobody cares. They, they love don't. it. They, they love us. They do. We love us anyway, love whether us. they don't. We, we go back and watch our own videos. <laughs> <laughs> Today's back day, though, so we're probably going to do four exercises for back and probably three, two or three for biceps today. Still going to do a compound movement. My back, I'm old. My back's a little tight and sore lately, so I, I'm just kind of being smart when it comes to deadlifts. So what we're probably going to do is do deadlifts on our lighter day. Yeah, and, yes. Uh, 
which I don't want to get into that no, too much because that's that's, a, that's what we'll talk not about what after. This video is about right today. Yes. It's just about changing up our training split and uh, let you guys know to let you guys know how the results are going. So maybe it's something you want to try. Sore. 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 Triceps are a little little bit sore. But I did triceps yesterday. I talk about it a lot, but we do compound movements. Shoulders are always Compound sore. movements are important, guys, for muscle growth. Uh, you can go to the gym and do your little glamour muscles all the you want, like curls and triceps and isolation movements, but you got, you got to do your compound movements. Bench press, squats, some kind of chest press. It involves your front delts, your chest, your pecs, your triceps. Those are compound movements. And if you're doing them standing versus seated, then it's, you're throwing in legs and stability muscles, back muscles, core muscles. Those are compound movements. Crucial to muscle growth. Crucial. I'm a professionalism. It's a professional. <laughs> I wish I was. I am a certified personal trainer. You are my professional. I am. But I do not have a formal education in exercise science. Oh, okay. Let's but be clear. Experience. Like, no, I'm not going to claim to be something I'm not. I'm not. Involves. But experience goes a long way. Yes, it I does. Mean, just, I mean, it absolutely does. C.T. Fletcher is one that, I mean, his, his experience alone, I don't know if he's got any certifications. He don't need them. Look at him. He's like I the king of weightlifting. You don't know him, do you? <laughs> yeah. You're new to this whole world. New to it, but I kind of like the way things are. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Like, comment, share. Later. Later.